Okay, uh, here's another product that I, I would never buy. Okay, got it from the food bank. It's got a heck of a lot of flavor, but little substance. It's like I can eat it, and it's hard to stop eating it. And uh, it's just, it's not very filling, though. Um, I feel like a sense of guilt after eating it, eating what I did eat. Cause it just, it, I still have the, the, the almost that there's no aftertaste anymore but it's just I still recall it it's that the flavor is strongly on my mind and um I but I don't feel like uh I've really uh realized any any uh good benefit does this echo pretty good okay let's get the let's get the history going here um I got some writing on the back. All right, they're selling their product. I hate to 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 speak badly of Kettle Brand, but they're just they're just a simple snack food uh, type of um, business, and they don't really offer anything of great nutritional value. Naturally flavored popcorn. Maple bacon. See, there's really no bacon, though. I think the bacon comes from the, sh the smoke. There's some chili pepper. But, uh, yeah, I I could never buy this stuff. I would want to pop popcorn separately. And I'm trying to figure that out a little bit better. On what I can do to, to pop popcorn effectively. There are ways, um, when you're homeless, to do it. Although just eating good corn product is always good too. Maple ba bacon popcorn. I ate it about, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes ago. And I was just waiting to see if I'd feel any kind of health after effects. Because sometimes, like, I, I when I was a teenager, I ate sun chips. And I, I, I pretty much, I think I puked them or I felt like I had to puke them up. I ate the whole bag. They were just so um, addictive. This is an addictive thing too, um, but I just I don't really feel nasty. I just I feel I feel kind of a sense of guilt about eating them because they just don't they just don't seem that rewarding. Okay, the just uh, after having eaten them, I, I don't I don't feel like I've really benefited. A lot. There's just an overwhelming amount of taste, but little value as a result. Um, and yeah, it's just a sense of disappointment. Like out of all that taste, there should have been a lot more. You know, I should be like feeling stuffed, and I'm not feeling stuffed. So it, uh, you know, like it's it's supposed to it's supposed to simulate eating pancakes, bacon, and eggs. But I haven't, I haven't, uh, I don't feel full like I've eaten all that. I feel kind of empty like I could eat more. So it's, it's kind of, it's a big tease. And it's not something I want to turn to very often. This one time, that's it. If I saw him at the food bank again, I don't think I'd even take it. Just trying a one time. I know what it's like. And once again, it's another American unregulated food product that uh, just doesn't really offer much. Since 1982? Is that how old Kettle brand is? <laughs> it's, it's, I'm older than Kettle, huh? They've been growing in popularity, I guess. Still. Um, yeah, I end it.